Also, in theory, I shouldn't be killing anything because that powers up the avatar. Ooh, that's something. Oh, hey, you can still be targeted by imposter tongue, huh? I wonder if that means you can be taken out by just a vantage in this form. You know, are you. Well, that was odd. Thanks for messing around in Vampire Cybers 238. That does not start. Migo Impostorina is heading over to Lake Foscari and showing off Can You Go? Full consumption from the start and be better than regular. Yes, that is clearly a line of thought. That is correct. And for that, I will be running the exact same build as last time. Or, well, regular Rena Impostorin did. That's Garlic Silver Wind and Pasta Tongue, Sharp Tongue. Sharp Tongue, Sharp Tongue, Garlic. Soul Eater, Silver Wind, Festa Wind. Palm Roller, Metaglio Left. Well, if it gives me Sharp Tongue, I don't even know if it will. I mean, it'd be strange if it didn't. I'm pretty sure you can. Take the left. Dark wares protect the bear. Dark powers protect the bear. Not dark protection protects the bear. Yes, that is clearly a sentence that is constructed correctly and in no way complete nonsense. I do make sure to have the sharp tongue unlocked. Normally it shows up so quickly. Oh. I can't max, if it doesn't show up, then I'll just go grab Paco Batelier, I guess. That would be not great, but hey. What reason would I have to not have it? Oh, there you are, Sharp Tongue. Now, Imposter, Megalo, Rena, Tongue's everything. Alright, go get my Arcana. Can I evolve yet? Let's see if I can evolve yet. Best of wins. Festivist of wins. I'm getting hurt. Alrighty. That's quick and effective, hopefully. Get you some festive wind gloriousness. I'll watch that damage soar into the stratosphere. And it just stacks endlessly. Look at that, going up to 300 a hit now. Best of Winds is incredibly good. Never underestimate it. Uh, Garlic will now evolve into Soul Eater. Well, if that chest evolved... Huh. It was an awkward situation. Alright, Arcana Chest, what did I get for before? I think it was... It was Sarabon Day of Healing, wasn't it? Well, we're gonna serenade you with healing then. Yeah, take him down. Hey, Mini Imposter. And that's five sharper tongues. I mean, it's very obvious that Imposter Arena is going to outperform regular Arena. But Megalo Imposter Arena is going to outperform regular Imposter Arena. Jeez. Two characters with the exact same name. Doing it for the third. Wow, I'm way out of position. Okay, I'm going to have to go way to the right then. The path basically no one takes. Why go here when you can go through the village and have some fun? Alright, Atlantean, let's get you down. Slam me with as many festive winds as possible. Da -da -da. 300. 300. Ouch, they just go down in no time at all, huh? 
still no evolution. Imagine how much better it would be if I actually had a third weapon, which I do have. If I had Empty Tome, I had a fourth passive item slot, passive weapon slot. As the winds is so strong. Oh, dang it. Well, not that I had a choice, but Festive Winds on Party Horse build? Oh, yeah. That would be the ultimate Party Horse. Now, I'm making a reference to Ultimate Chicken Horse or Party Horse from regular show. Make your decision down below, commenters. Here. Tear them up, rip them apart. Metaglio left, which is still me Taglio left. I just keep mispronouncing it, even though I had a whole conversation with myself about how I was wrong. Watch that damage spike. Get it all the little petals. So I can do it better. You don't exist, boss. Go away. Jeez. Actually, one of the few weapons where speed is helpful. The faster they swirl, the better protection you have. Hey, it's a chest. And this one will evolve something. No, I get a free 10 minute candy box from a chest. Talk about wonky luck. 41 no luck modifier. Really, I must go grab all the clovers to fix that. Hey, the path was correct. Muscle memory has come through. Haha. Uh -huh. Having either muscle or memory. Funny. Right, tongue valves off many, so I don't need to worry about anything else. Yep. More speed on them wings of wind. Pedals on the wind. Watch how it soars. Golden egg. Go faster, best of winds. Faster, faster until you blow the whole world apart. Yeah, to get the last thumb clovers. Please evolve. Yay, soul year. Soul taker. Talk about a song I'll never be able to sing. You put the lyrics right in front of me while I'm pasta tongue was sure fast after that. Alright, now I can hit flip on random always and win. Hey, it's the Arcana. And because it's Lake Foscari and that final wave is not so, it's awakened in time. Now yeah, time to put the controller down and have and pos have the stalker show up immediately. He walks free passive rosary. Bam. That's a rosary for sure, so it takes about three hmm. It's about 30 seconds after the 12 minute mark. Nothing else should be threatening until we get laid in, and that's a laid in. Oh, hey. Uh, those fish things. Was it the kobolds? The kobold fishermen. They explode into a dust cloud, but if they get destroyed by imposter tongue, the dust cloud is bigger, too. Yeah. Fire breathing. Was that my random roll? I looked away for a second just to make sure I was recording correctly. Juna Kwa Neo Melo Impostorina. That one I am sure is Megalo. Mitaglio Megalo. Ghost Swarm. Why is it yellow? It's because you can kill ghosts to get X Dash. That's why they're yellow in the uh, Gar's Gouda. Bestiary. Bestiary. 
Got a lot of ghosts rushing in. Hmm. Light sources. Oh no. Level up time. Do -do -do. Okay, so it's every 30 seconds past the minute that it rolls the random roulette. And about 25 in. Oh, oops. I told you I'd take my hands off the controller. Granted, it didn't last much longer after that, but still, that's a revive I needed. And of course, it's a passive. Okay, so 30 seconds after. Panic time. Takes about 25 seconds for it to roll, and then. Oh, panic time. The oh, tricksters thing. Then about three seconds after the minute, it starts spawning in. It looks like. Eesh, you're still getting in through this nonsense. I'm healing quite a bit. Well, I don't know what passives Re Megalo Arena has, because, well. Not like anything is said with I'm not the imposter. And more tongue in action for her, him, thee, thine, thy, they, their, thyin, those in. There's a vacuum. Okay, so yellow is just indicating which one you get. So skull swarm. So it's actual skulls, not skeletons. Skeletons. More red jamming. You know, I would have the perfect excuse for yesterday. Do not play Pal World and instead play more Holo Gear on stream. Tongue them. Tongue them snakes. Show them which one is the really long one. Oh, hey, Super Candy Box 2 Turbo. Too bad I can't. Evolve anything past the limits of Spartacus. Yes, clearly. Clearly correct. Give me that other Arcana chest, which is now a regular chest, because I already have all three Arcana for the run. Chest tool, my tool. Rule of three for me. But not for thee. Jimmin', 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 jimmin' around. Alright, what even is my random event roulette going with? Hmm. I wonder if Avatar of Guy is going to be vulnerable to Festive Winds debuff. Buff up that damage endlessly. Oh, hey, Bone Towers. Let's get rid of use. Wow, they got separated. Why didn't they spawn on the right correctly? Huh. Of course, it had to be a Clover, something I would have already had on the map if I was playing normally. Ooh, Clover. It's lucky. Rolling for random. Fire breathing, yay! That's what happens when your mouth is open that much. You get bad breath. 
baddest of breath. Fire breath. Burn them all. Burn them all. Burn, 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 burn. These green knights. Dun, 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 dun. Burn, 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 burn them all, all. Oh, right, you're invincible right now. Also, in theory, I shouldn't be killing anything because that powers up the avatar. Ooh, that's something. Oh, hey, you can still be targeted by Imposta Tongue, huh? I don't know if that means you can be taken out by just Vanded in this form. You know, are you. Well, that was odd. So, I guess Avatar of Gaia isn't immune to instant kill from a pasta tongue. Didn't know that, so. Knowledge has been gained, and your power has increased. I'd have better reactions if I wasn't so drop dead tired. Ah, who am I kidding? I don't react to much. I underreacting, I promote my supreme self confidence in everything I do. It's very impressive when you are as bad at video games as I am. Tell him. Give him the tongue. Oh, how's the boss one? Man, just hitting pretty nice and consistently hard. Heck, I'm even managing to survive some of the hits in here. Big green knights. Wow, can I go through without wasting a revive? I mean, it'll be mostly because of the luck coming from like, getting the chicken for right at the exact same time, but hey. Nope, very close though. That's a very impressive run. Ah, discard. I don't need no luck. Which means I do need luck. Give me back the clover. Give it back. Give me that luck. And luck will save this run. Ten luck will save this run. Ten luck will save this run. Dun dun dun. Thirty thirty, and an attract orb at the bottom. Well, if you're gonna be here, I'm gonna take you out. Well, if I can. And I did. Nice. No, I won't get the golden egg. And impasta tongue. Impasta tongues to victory. Time for Imposter Migalo Arena. You head over to the Astral Stair and find out just what's so sus about what's hiding under the stairs. Oh, that's what it is. That hourglass symbol. That was what was sus. Oh, sharp tongue from the start this time. Sharp tongue from the start this time. Silver wind. Silver wind. And the Imposter is minied. It's nice to have a character with some actual oomph in there for obvious on Astral Stair. It's been a while, it feels like. Well, more because I keep selecting the worst possible weapons. Like, oh boy. Tongue all of them dust elementals. The best way to clean dust is with your tongue. Don't you know it? After all, you're just returning your dead skin flakes to your body. And why is there so much dust in the rooms I barely go in is a question for another time. Perhaps I sleepwalk there. Constantly. Endlessly. It's thicker than the spot I normally sleep to. So maybe it does make sense. Boy howdy. When you can write your name in it, make it legible when you're full of standing, you know you got a dust problem. 
Hmm. I wonder if the endless dust is getting in my throat and causing all these scratchings. Well, that's a question for me to forget the moment I am off of this game. Oh, I do need to clean some today. But it is a Tuesday, and it is already predetermined. It's like... Sunday. Is predetermined. Oh, and Thursday is predetermined. Oh, hey, I was able to get to it. Wow, no garlic yet. It's kind of impressive in a strange way. Hmm, I wonder if I could get an NFT and then run into the golden finger to get some glory doing. But well, overall, my ability to hit things away from the body of old Megalo Imposterina here is very limited. You get in close, you're gonna get dusted. Stay far away, I'm a toast. Well, you're still gonna be toast. It'll just be slower and less efficient. Man, they don't want to give up the garlic at all, huh? All right, Metaglio. Er, well. Metaglio. Well, I sure hope I get a random passive from the roulette. Da, 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 da. Oh, hey, it finally gives me an idea for a fifth wave. Terrible, terrible idea. Oh, yeah. No trouble with fifth wave then. Garlic, 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 garlic. Yummy garlic. Yummy mummy man. Oh, right. I don't want levels. Stand still and let them all suffer the wrath of Megalo and Posterina. Hey, Arcana Chest, how's it going? That'll keep them further back so they won't drop anything chesty in my sight. Hmm. Far away is that chest? Oh, it's on the other room, of course. Oh, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? No, I'm adulting you. Oh ho! Back through the door. Stand still. Stand still, stand tall. That chest is not going to be anything, and I'm going to grab it anyway. Ah. Ghost swarm. I don't even need to worry about that. Also, timely that's with the ghosts on the map. And Megalo and Pastorina consume more. Yes, that's six words. Because apparently that's the magic number for getting people interested in the thumbnail. I mean, it's probably bad that I have vampire survivors in every stage with every character off at the top there. Being eight. Wrecking everything. Owie. Well, I can heal off that. I can heal off that pretty well. I mean, heck, wouldn't festive winds really be the thing you want for no moving? Does more damage, it heals more. Back to the same area as Soul Eater. And garlic. Hey, a treasure chest. And it's a pasta tongue. Well, at least I can do something now. Stay still. Inaction is something. It's inaction. It's inactive. Green swarm. What's... Oh, those bloated green blobs. Yeah. Ow, 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 ow. 
Oh, poor Megalo. Your legs don't work no more. Wow, that was so many. Hey, it's time to awaken the true power of Megalo Impostorina. With awake. Jeez. It's been going on for like the whole minute, hasn't it? Close enough. And that wasn't random event, that was stage event. Get more chicken. Chicken was the event. No wait, it was green swarm. Roll them bones. 30. Actually more like 32, or maybe it's desynced because it's on hurry. Ultra wave. 52, 53 ish. So I have 20 seconds to roll it. Now, does Ultra Wave just spawn in whatever the current wave is, but in bigger form? Hey, nice. Now I can go grab a vacuum. And it's random always for random winning. That was a nice chunk of levels. An NFT or anything in here? Chew them up, spit them out. Finger of gold. Yep, that's not gonna go very well. Got 600 for a silver, jeez. Terrible. Probably could have held out for a weaker enemy wave, but I don't like the big heads. They're annoying. They're big. They're heady. And Megalo has had their form of eating heads today. Yes, form. Clearly the correct word, and not fail. English is a simple language filled with contradictions and nonsense. I can go through the golems a lot easier. That's a surprise. Oh man, cosmic egg. You're me into the debuff, aren't you? It's hard to tell. Yeah, you're moving to the debuff, so that limits its viability. Well, still, you went down. Not too slowly. I nice candy box on the right. Well, to the right, to the right. Oh, whoops. Thought it was a different setup. Okay, much faster when I'm not fighting giant heads. Demon Finger should not get cosmic though. Ripple my score. Get some money. Money, money, money. Money. Too bad it doesn't affect Gorgeous Moon and Pendagram. I think Christine might have not had a horrible, horrible time here. Kill them all. Hey, oh, it's okay, oh, for you to die, all. Oh. That was a starburst. Well, that was timely. This was a good build for Astral Stare. Give some pushback, does a lot of damage. We don't have to worry that much about the cosmic eggs, pulling off cosmic egg nonsense. And I got lucky with some chickens. Oh, 
really lucky with some chickens. Oh, stop it. Oh, dang it. Oh, yep it. Quitting time, time to quit the game. Imposter tongue. And time for Imposter Megalo Arena to go over to Carlo Car. Can't stop moving, can't stop eating, can't stop winning. Da -da -da. Um, Rolla is not what I want. Garlic. Garlic is harder to find. Well, it's... Yep. And yep again. That figures. Oh, right. I'm not getting Metaglo here either. Uh-oh. Uh, er, uh, um, hmm, er, um. I got Armadillo. Sure, it's only one level of empty tome, but it's better than nothing. Well, that just proves that everything is pointless and the results don't matter. So eat all your enemies alive. Hey, a chest. All Marola in time. It's gonna be forever for me to get Silver Wind, isn't it? it might not even evolve things. Oh, that tongue is shooting out far to hit the bats up there. And we're coasting to the right. Wait, what am I doing? I have a right joystick. I can use to select these while keeping my finger... Wait, a thumb is not a finger. While keeping my thumb on the go right on the d-pad. Oh, festive winds. You haven't shown up at all because you're festive winds, which is the evolution, so you can't show up. You haven't shown up again either, silver wind, after I... Picked a garlic over you. Da, da, da. Base area up again. No, none of them will survive the top. Keep your hands where I can see them. Base area up. Give them a tongue lashing. See me re-roll and da, 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 da. Boy, it would be nice to get something. I don't have that many weapons left. Yeesh. I did not eliminate it. Well, time to start banishing. What a weird situation we find ourselves in with Migolo Imposter Runa. Mispronounce everything. Wait, boat you. More like one away gone. Hey. A lap, a lap, a lap around town. What shall we get? Good gravy. Why are you not giving me the silver wind? It's all I want in life. How many times am I going to have to see this report show up? Here, um, it's joysticking time. See you, laser. See you later. Lizard, 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 lizard. Our shot's showing up a lot, too. There we go, there's Soul Eater. There we go, Silver Wind. 
finally you showed your beautiful, beautiful face. What is today? The day... Or Thurie's Day. Yeah. Oh. Huh. So truly there is a fourth day. Forza. Oh man, Rider. To the rescue. Alright, the Arcana chest should be coming up real soon. Yep, yeah, that figures. Silver winds blowing in the hot desert air. That figures. And it is time to re-roll into Slash. Yes, clearly I intended this from the very beginning. That's why you don't want to pop your re-rolls. Yeah, that figures. I will hit right with everything. So I'll go triple speed and right into the stalker. You know, I suppose in theory, that means you could technically play three characters with one controller because you got three directional inputs and you don't need buns for anything else. Strange, isn't it? And I just missed another chest, didn't I? Sleepy time. Time for Megalo to sleep. Take a nap and grow stronger by consuming the flesh and blood of your enemies. Don't oh, get back here, boss. I don't mean get back there there. I mean get back there when I'm in line with you so I can get your dang chest. There we go. Ooh, double evolution. Well, it should have been double evolution. The eyes. The eyes. Are meaningless compared to the maw. What do eyes do but see when the maw consumes it? There we go. With festive winds, we're putting that speed to maximum and going on hard. Now we are. Right on the D-pad is right to victory. Down the Carlo Kart way. Hey, it's a Diffang Drowner. Wait, why are you colored correctly? Well, let's pal- oh, wow. You went away quickly. And Melise. Well, let's see how fast you two can go away if you get- No. Oh, I guess it just- Oh, hey, that's a Defanged Shadower. Yep, you're Defanged. I don't know why the color is suddenly working all of a sudden, but you are. Anyway, it's the right time. Let's see if I can defang Maddener. Nope. You're still defanged, which is odd. Oh, is it actually the same one every time instead of their weird respawn situation? On other stages? Probably why I can notice it so consistently here instead. Eesh, I got two of them. In the same stage. Yep, you're still defanged. You do no damage if you're defanged. So defang all your enemies, including the crab battle that shows up right now. Oh, right by it. Get going, get going, get going down those tracks. And here's all of them. Including... Oh, regular stalker can spawn in here. Huh. It's the first time I think I've seen him. Ever famous double stalker. That's a thumbnail. Uh-oh. Oh wait, that should banish all of you. Because it's the end of the stage. And Big Brother redeems the bloodline. 
Not even... Oh, you got almost a billion just because you kept wiping out the stalkers and his brothers, eh? And with Megalo Arena's success, 464, it's been taken down on the Beswick. 465 over here in Astor. And 466 on Carlo Kart, speeding along, eh? That takes down everyone on the third wave at least once, though we do have to go back up here for Antonio and Co. to catch up with their numbers. But after that, it'll be on to the fourth wave, which will be a lot funner and hopefully a lot faster. Thanks for watching. I hope you had some fun. Like, dislike, comment, and subscribe if you haven't. If you have, please, please thank you and all that good stuff. Either way, have a good day and keep messing around in the Vampire Survivors Beswick.